What happened there? The dog attacked him and ripped his arm completely off. That was part of a shocking 911 call made after a dog attack in Westchester. Thanks for joining us again at 5. I'm Megan O'Rourke. And I'm Rob Williams and Patricia Mackey, who is out on special assignment. The attack happened at a home along Cincinnati Dayton Road earlier today. Now, we should warn you, the details of this story are graphic in nature and may be difficult for some of our viewers to hear. Westchester 911, where is your emergency? I need, I, need, I need an ambulance with emergency care for an arm being completely broke off. By a dog. That's the call that sent Westchester police and fire down this private drive to help a man who the caller said was in his 70s or 80s. She told dispatchers the man had been attacked by his own dog. The Butler County dog warden tells us this is the dog that attacked the owner. The sheriff's office says it's a 93 pound pit bull. In an effort to stop one dog from attacking the owner, the female victim let the other pit bull out of its cage to distract the first dog. That allowed both of them to get to a safe place and call for help. So the dogs were inside. It had been reported that they had been fighting. Um, so we were going to contain the dogs to cages, check them out, and go from there. The sheriff's office tells us once the second dog was released, the dogs began to fight with one another. Both were found with blood on them when the dog warden arrived. They were fairly calm. They both were very bloody from fighting with each other. So they were both worn out. Sheriff's office sedated the dogs and later euthanized both dogs involved. The owner was taken to the hospital with what Westchester described as severe arm injuries. And that was Ken Brown reporting. We showed you a picture of the dog when it was sedated and it has since been euthanized. Also, the woman you heard on the phone also sustained injuries to her hand and arm, but those injuries were less serious.